Represented, my name is Jesse Jongwe. The headlines. Chama and the co-accused refuses to visit the crime scene. PF accuses HH of hood winking Zambians on the law of rural demands Chama's release from cells. Home Affairs Minister Jack Mwimbui unhappy at the low pace of Mumbeshi construction works. Felix Mutati strikes dissolves Zampo's board. Mwensa residents appeals for hospital equipment. In sports, a soccer analyst advises fans to appoint a permanent coach to rebrand the team and other news in detail. Former Defense Minister Davis Chama has refused to drive to Sicily, the crime scene on ground that it was already visited during investigations and report was compelled six years ago. Mr. Chama's lawyer Tutuangulube, who is also former Cabo Central MP, has disclosed that his client at the moment are waiting if there will be any formal arrest so that they can press for police bond or get bail from the magistrate. However, Mr. Ngulube has expressed happiness with the conduct of police officers so far. Davis Chama, 57, and Brian Nyoni, 47, were arrested last week, Saturday, in connection of attempted murder of Mashaukwa in Molobezi district during a by-election in 2015. Meanwhile, the Patriotic Front of PF leadership has demanded for the immediate release of its acting national chairperson, Davis Chama, from police cells, where he has been since Saturday last week. PF chairperson for information and publicity, Rafael Nakachinda, says it is shocking that police have continued keeping Mr. Chama in police custody beyond the stipulated 48 hours, according to the law. He has charged that President Hakainde Hitlema has been in making citizens to believe that he means well in keeping the rule of law when he took